Okay, so the the current uh, Doris network has uh, 59 station very well distributed uh, geographically uh, to meet the needs of uh, space altimetry yeah and so this uh, homogeneous uh, distribution is also a very good point uh, for geodesy for the contribution to the itrf especially since uh, most of the station are uh, collocated with other space geodetic technique, as you can see uh, on this map. Um, <clears throat> uh, and we uh, try to perform a systematic uh, local tide survey um, on the occasion of uh, the risk field activities. In addition, um, near uh, half of the network station are located on island or coastal areas uh, with uh, collocation with tide gauges uh, to, to better contribute to uh, sea level uh, monitoring. Next slide, please. Uh, the um, current uh, status of the network operation is good. Um, all uh, is back to order after uh, two difficult years uh, due to the COVID uh, sanitary uh, crisis uh, that has considerably uh, complicated uh, field operation and, and maintenance, uh, as you can imagine. Um, and last year, uh, the annual mean of uh, active sites was around 88%. Uh, 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 and uh, we continue uh, on uh, this uh, same uh, good rate uh, this year, uh, thanks to the, the close monitoring of uh, the maintenance team uh, at CNES, uh, IGN, and our uh, local partners. Next slide, please. Uh, let's see uh, now the, the main uh, recent events. Uh, last year, uh, we <clears throat> we lost uh, the, the station we have uh, in Russia. Our partners uh, have been uh, ordered to shut down the station from the, their government uh, for undefined uh, period. So we we started to search uh, alternative sites uh, around, and we we should install uh, a new station in Mongolia uh, next year. The good news is that uh, we restarted uh, a number of stations that had uh, broken down uh, during the sanitary crisis. And uh, <clears throat> we set up a, a new station uh, in Easter Island, which uh, was uh, urgently uh, awaited to, to fill a, a, coverage, a coverage gap, as you can see on this map. Uh, over the, the South uh, Pacific Ocean. Next slide. Um, the outlook for the, the years to come. So uh, first regarding the tourist uh, ground equipment, uh, we will continue the deployment of the, uh, the, the fourth generation beacon and the Starex C uh, antenna. Um, on his side, uh, CNES is uh, developing a, a new onboard uh, receiver. Uh, second, we will uh, we will try to make the, the network denser uh, to improve the, the network coverage and uh, it also its uh, robustness. Uh, with a, a number of, of projects, as you can see on this slide. Um, so Easter Island uh, we, is already in operation and we are um, installing currently uh, a new Doris uh, station uh, in Crete at the ESA calibration site. And we, have, uh, we, will, we hope to have uh, three uh, new sites uh, uh, next year in Australia, in India and in uh, Mongolia. Uh, finally, we have uh, several uh, planet site uh, renovations to, uh, in order to uh, improve the, the station performance uh, with uh, antenna relocation uh, to, to have a, a better on environment. 
Uh, next slide. Yes, so um, this uh, graph shows the, the past and uh, the, the current uh, Doris Eclipse satellites. Uh, we have uh, currently uh, enough uh, Doris satellites in, in operation in green color. And um, we have a number of new missions uh, already uh, agreed uh, that uh, secures the, the future of Doris. Uh, uh, until at least uh, 2035. Next slide, please. Uh, lastly, uh, some uh, news about uh, IDS Life. Uh, a new Doris uh, special issue uh, was published uh, in July um, with about 10 articles about uh, new results uh, from Doris. The DIDS activity report 2021 is uh, available online and we, we are preparing the, the, the IDS activity report 2022 currently. We also try to regularly uh, distribute uh, newsletters uh, and for the next uh, news, newsletter we plan with IDS uh, to have uh, articles uh, in common about the collocation between uh, Doris and uh, Genesis. Uh, now, regarding the IDS governing board uh, members, we have uh, we had uh, elections at the end uh, of last year, and we have new new people, including uh, uh, Laura and uh, Claude Boniface from CNES uh, took over from Arno Sele uh, just uh, in, in September this year. Uh, finally, um, the, the, the next uh, meeting for the IDS uh, will be the, the IDS an Analysis Working Group uh, meeting uh, planned uh, in Paris at IGN at the end of uh, November, and we will uh, celebrate the 20th uh, uh, IDS anniversary. And I think uh, that's it. The next slide is to thank you for your attention.